Today we're doing smash burgers. Smash burgers are cool, fun, incredibly easy. You need a couple of things to get them going and I'm going to show you how you get to do it. With that, let's get it on. Firstly, you need to have one of these things. It is a cast iron press and you're going to be pressing your meatballs onto the griddle. You need to have some parchment paper and your press. You can get your press from anywhere, any outdoor store that does grills, Amazon. I got this one on Amazon, it was like $25, so nothing too expensive. We're gonna be putting on some olive oil onto the griddle to make sure that it enhances the flavor as well as to make sure that it doesn't stick. So with the ground beef, we are doing two size patties. The one patty is a quarter pounder, the other one is a holy moly half pounder. The only spice we're going to be using is black pepper. You do not need anything else, no fancy schmancy weird spice, just black pepper. If you guys like this video, please can you give it a thumbs up, share and subscribe. It goes a long way. Much appreciated. Okay, so now we have done the half pounder and the quarter pounder and now time to construct the burgers. So we uh, fried up the uh, onion. We have the lettuce as the bed. So this is a classic, simple, straightforward burger, nothing over the top, uh, leaving all the sauces out of it because the specialty item is the, is the patty. So the first one is the mammoth half pounder. And for the quarter pounder, we're gonna do a double. Wow, how awesome do these two burgers look? Let's cut them up and see what it's about. So they're both half pounders, two patties versus one patty. I would definitely go with the single. How awesome does the patty look? Okay, time to get into the taste. Stop messing around with what it looks like, how it looks. Hey, no wonder it doesn't look right. There's only one flipping patty on here. God, that is funny. You cannot even make this up if you tried. I am losing all of my bits. Okay, we have the double. How beautiful does the double look? 
No wonder I said I prefer to be single because there was only one patty. This is a good, delicious, wholesome, tasteful piece of meat. You can taste the pepper, but you're not, there's nothing that's overpowering in relation to having all of these spices going mad and all the sauce. So it's just a classic, tasteful, pure meat, enjoyable wowness. Let's check this one out. A smash burger is so simple, nothing complicated. You have a single spice, you have some olive oil that goes onto the roll. It just gets it that crunchy, toasty flavor. You have the, the burger, you have the tomato, the fried up onion, and the onions in a little bit of olive oil, but the real kicker is the juices out of the meat that fries up those onions to that golden brown, delicious flavor. My word, this is awesome. Like, guys, seriously, this is not difficult in any way. You don't need to go and pre-purchase your, your, your burger patties from the store. You don't need to go and buy a burger this is just so simple, anyone can do it. This is absolutely scrumptious. And on that note, catch you guys on the next one.